And after weeks of public hearings and closed door meetings, legislative leaders have reached a bipartisan agreement on new gun laws. News 8's Aaron Cox is live outside the state capitol with the details. Good morning, Aaron. Hey guys, it's been the legislative leaders doing all the negotiations, but now all the other lawmakers are going to get a look at this legislation crafted in a direct response to the shootings at the Sandy Hook Elementary School. The Hartford Current reporting that Democratic and Republican legislative leaders hammered out the agreement. They're supposed to present it to their full caucuses later today. The focus has been on expanding background checks, also on expanding the ban on assault weapons and high capacity ammunition magazines. Now, this comes just a few days after newly released documents show that the home of the Newtown shooter contained hundreds of rounds of ammunition that were all purchased legally. Those same documents also revealing that at the school, investigators report recovering 153 spent shell casings, and they estimate all those bullets fired in under five minutes. Again, the caucus is going to get their look at this proposal today. Lawmakers are scheduled to be in session on Wednesday. It's unclear if they'll all get on board in time to bring it up for a vote then. We're live outside the state capitol this morning. I'm Erin Cox, News 8.